It's all coming, brothers. Worse than the days of Noah. That's right. That's right. When you go to uh, I'm, well, let me go ahead and get a little small cell. Brother, we're gonna brothers. We're gonna see things during these days that we would have never expected to see in our entire lives. Right Just on. complete pandemonium out here. Right Death on. and destruction on a worldwide scale. As it says, the hor the blood shall be up to the horse's, horse's bridle. bridle, and that's pretty damn high. I got it. It says, um, uh, Daniel's twelve and one. And at that time shall Michael stand up, the great prince was standing for the children of thy people. And there, and there shall be a time of trouble which never was since was a nation even to the same time, man. And, and at that time thy people shall be delivered, everyone that shall be found, shall be found written in the book. You have to understand, man, we coming into some treacherous, I'm talking about crazy times, man. It's like those post-apocalyptic movies you see where people are in the desert worrying about cannibals and all that kind of right. It's going to be worse than that. That's right. Because that's just out of somebody's vain imagination. Kind, kind. I'm talking about when they really start to get trifling out here, all these fast food eaters that want to just have a taste of flesh, you know what I mean, that just want some meat. Hey. Motherfuckers going to turn the zombies out here. Hey, eating their supposedly... Uh, human meat in those McDonald's burgers, so they already got a taste for it. They already got that connected to their genetic makeup, man. Mm -hmm. I don't know why I got a, a taste for flesh, but I'm gonna eat uh, I'm gonna eat a person a day. And not just that, think about all these people on antidepressants and medications Ooh. out here. Yeah. Some people can't go without taking their pills, so you're gonna have straight demons yeah. out here. I'm talking about people gonna be in on survival mode. You know what a I mean? Crazy, just, yeah, a crazy, crazy person. Just, yeah. A crazy person. And they're gonna have, yeah. and the Most High is gonna have these spirits roaming around and getting on people, legion. So people gonna be around here like that one dude that broke those chains, just yeah. doing all kinds of madness. And on top of that, you got Esau coming with this technology, with those robotic killers, with his uh, super soldiers, with soldiers hopped up on uh, amphetamines. Yeah. Hey man, America gonna be a fucking wasteland, man. Real soon coming to uh, a theater <laughs> near you. Right. <laughs> I think I'm on that mark. No, uh, okay, I got that Luke. Yeah, that Luke. This is Luke 11 and uh, 49. Therefore, also said the wisdom of the Most High, I will send them prophets and apostles, and some of them they shall slay and persecute. That's right, man. Keep hammering in the they point. Keep hammering in the point, man. Letting you know exactly what you signed up for. Kind. This is the Whedon. We're in the 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 separating the yeah. the the chaff from the wheat right that's now. Right, that's right. That's where you're seeing a lot of people fall out. That's right. You got to know what you're a part of. Hey, I'm going to tell you like this. Even if, even if you wasn't preaching this word, those things were still going to happen, man. Mm -hmm. These things are still going to happen to this country. Your mom going to be in a bad position. Your father's going to be in a bad position. Your child, your woman going to be in a bad position, man. So why not? So what the on, fuck? Yeah. What? Cleveland said this word, man. Like, <laughs> ain't nothing getting better in this society, man. So what are we? What what are men like us to do that don't have nothing? We gonna cleave unto something that has allowed us to have something. That's your how about Shem Yahweh man. A place of a place of uh to be saved. Yeah. Out of all this, because like the brother just said. You can do this word and have a chance of being saved, but if you don't do this word, you're still going to get thrown into the same meat blender. It's the same thing. It's the same thing, man. You just ain't got no covering. That's it. Hey, what it? Let me get it real quick. What does it say in Amos chapter 5, verse 18? Woe unto you that desire the day of Yahweh. To what end is it for you? The day of Yahweh is darkness and not light. As if a man did flee from a lion and yeah. a bear met him, or went into the house and leaned his hand on the wall and a serpent bit him. And that's terror after terror, man. It's going to be non-stop, 24-7. Yeah. <laughs> you just stumbling into shit, like, damn. You may get out, and you might not even get a second's respite after uh, fleeing one calamity before the other one befalls you. That's right. And that's without the covering. And with the covering, we're still going to go through all kinds of madness, but we still got that chance to be saved. That's right. That's right. That's right. 
Yeah, so I'm yeah. kind of at that John. I agree. This is John 15. I'm going to start at verse 19. Yep. If ye were of the world, the world would love his own. Mm -hmm. But because ye are not of the world, but I have chosen you out of the world, therefore the world hateth you. So you got to understand something, man. All we doing is making, all we doing is making, I call it an election show. So therefore we're separating ourselves from the ones that want to be here and from the, and, and, and putting ourselves in the position of those who don't want to be here, man. So therefore they're going to hate us for that. And that's fine, man. We'll take that hate. You know why? Because that hate is in righteousness, man. We don't have a problem with that. You know, we're going to push this truth and truth and sincerity, man. That's what's going, that's what's going to give us real love. Because all this fake love from these people ain't getting us nowhere. It's not substantial. It's not substantial. Substantial. It's not, it don't, it don't uh, 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 edify you. It don't build you up, man, all this fake love, man. Hey, they hate us because they ain't us. Simple. Because in their spirit, they can see that what we're doing is right. right. And we're a, a witness unto them, not giving them the cloak for their maliciousness, mm -hmm. showing them that they're living like brute beasts. That's right. Not living the right way. Right. Where you keep reading? Verse 20. Remember the word that I said unto you, the servant is not greater than his Lord. If they have persecuted me, they will also persecute you. If they have kept, if they have kept my saying, they will keep yours also. That's right, man. So you know what they're going to do? They're going to go ahead and uh, uh, demonize us, man. Just like they demonize you, how was y'all, man? Oh, he said this? Oh, he said that? Hey, he casts out demons like Beelzebub. Oh, you the king of the Jews? So you think you're greater than, a, than our heavenly father? Just like us. Oh, so y'all y'all, so y'all think y'all got the truth? Yes. You niggas is the devil, man. How you going to call the, 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 the Roman Catholic Church... How you gonna say this about it? How you how you say the white man's a demon, a <laughs> devil? Right, right. These are the things that they're gonna get us for, man. Our word that we use on a daily basis on the highways and byways, even our words that we use on these videos, man. And we let it be known. It ain't like we hide nothing. This did did Yahweh shy hide? I mean, no, I did, high. did the apostles hide? I mean, they they fled when when shit got bad, but yeah. they still went out. They didn't let. Oh, I'm, that's how you know Yahweh shy was amazing because they, they they cornered the lord and it wasn't that time he, i don't know how he got a body in there but he was gone <laughs> you know so these are the things that the lord just allow us to put ourselves in position to do man hey and some brothers are going to get powers like that in that day Come. this is uh Thanks. acts chapter 5 verse 40 yeah and to him they agreed and when they had called the apostles and beaten them they commanded that they should not speak in the name of Yahavashai and right. let them go. That's right, man. So, hey, man, we coming into some beautiful times, man. We coming into some times where, hey, they want us off the corner ASAP, man. What are y'all doing? No, y'all ain't to be talking that Yahavashai mess up here, man. All that Yahavashim, no, man, y'all got to go. You black Hebrew Israelite. And we're going to be right back. We're just going to go, if we lose one spot, we're just going to go to another spot. Simple. Verse 41. Yep. And they departed from the presence of the council, rejoicing that they were counted worthy to suffer shame for his name. Ooh, ain't that, ain't that amazing? Like, you brothers don't, don't feel that in your spirit? To be counted worthy to suffer for your how about Shem Yahweh man? Man. Hey, I'm at least speaking for myself, but any any brother that's been in this truth, I I at least think, begin uh, when you were in this world, you kind of had that rebellious spirit towards this world, knowing that things weren't right. right. So you're always saying some kind of smart ass comment to, to people on this world. Now you just know what you need to say. That's right. You hey, this world. You still let uh ask? I wanted that last little part. I, I got. Kind of. Oh, I'm oh. still here. Oh. This is uh, 42. 42, and daily in the temple and in every house they cease not to teach and preach Yahweh Shai HaMashiach. And that's what we're going to do, man. You know what we're not going to do? We're not going to sit up on this video talking about Jesus Christ, man. Going in and out, you know what I mean? We're going to preach Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai, man. Or making fucking t-shirts and rap songs. That's right, man. We're not finna do that, man. Because a lot of you niggas say that the minute the Lord's scared, you niggas is scared, man. You niggas have chose a side, man. Hey, we haven't changed up the doctrine. We're still using the name. Hey! And we're still going out on the highways and byways. Hey. And like as the brothers always say, 
we're not going to do anything to you, but I mean, if you lay hands on us, I mean, somebody's going to the hospital that night. Hey, man, that's simple. Go ahead. Con, this is Job 38 and 3. Yep. Gird up now thy loins like a man. I'm yep. going to read that again. Mm -hmm. Gird up thy loins like a man, for I will demand of thee and answer thou me. Hey, man, a lot of you niggas is pansies, man. I'm going to say it like that. You're pansies, man. You got your 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 your, your panties all in a bunch, man. You're moist. You're moist, man. You hear me? You're gonna have your butt in the breeze in that day, man. You're gonna be in a bad position. You know why? Because you're not following in the footsteps of the men that have taught you, man. They teach you how to gird up your loins. Now look at you niggas out here, man. You niggas are being exposed for the ignorant, just nonsensical. Just uh, 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 blatantly. A nigga art. That's all you been, man. Just all this. You trying to elude all this goddamn confidence, man. You are going to get the same pressure that we going to get, man. Now, what you going to do with it? You're going to stay sucking on your thumb. You're going to rock that motherfucking shirt. And you're going to say, I'm one of you. Look, I, 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 I proclaim black. Get the Israelites. <laughs> hey, I, exactly. Yeah, I am black. <laughs> you know what I mean? I am an African American. <laughs> I'm black. Fuck. Well, you silly bitch. This is a uh, Second Timothy chapter one verse seven. Yeah. For the Most High hath not given us the spirit of fear. That's right, man. That's the reason why, within this truth, we continue to proclaim what that we are the Hebrew Israelite that the Bible speaks of. From Genesis to Revelation, man. And boldness like a lion. That's extreme enough. <laughs> I ain't finna be going out here saying I'm black. I don't need to do that. I'm gonna get my ass whipped for saying I'm an Israelite. Not because I'm saying I'm a black extremist. Hey, man. I'd rather get my ass whipped for what I am than what I'm not. That's <laughs> simple. You know? Go ahead, huh? I'll just reread it. Okay. For the Most High hath not given us the spirit of fear, but of power and of love and of a sound mind. And that's simple, man. Power, love, and a sound mind. You see how I ended with the sound mind? How do you have a sound mind, man? By constantly moving in the flow of the proper doctrine, man. Girding up your loins like a man, not wavering to and fro. That's right, man. I'm trying to find different loopholes to make a video about this and that. If you ain't got nothing to say, man, just shut up, man. Shut the fuck up. That's simple. Because we're, as we get closer and closer to the end times, we're, the men of the Lord don't have time to hear your bullshit. Have you come up and try to have a debate? This is past the time of debate. This is about to be a, a, a spiritual war out That's here. That's right, man. Slaughter is finna happen on a high level. So with that, man, Lord willing, you brothers with edify, man. We want once again give all praise and infinite honor unto Yahweh by Shem, Yahweh Shah, by Shem, Rekakwadash. Double honor to the elders of Pazza, great mills on the salutation to all you brothers, man. Putting his words, truth and sincerity. Shalom. Shalom.